Hey y'all, my name is Victoria B. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, I'm going to do a real quick video, try to make it fast. Um, I just received a channel message about a, a divine feminine and a divine masculine situation, okay? And I pulled some oracle cards to try to make it go faster. My reading, Spiritual Tea, messages by Lorena OG Tarot. All right, we have Cleanse Home. Tantric sex, which is sex in the 5D. Evil Eye, protect yourself. Lemuria, great Atlantis, a past life connection to Atlantis. Crown chakra, seventh chakra, imbalance. Dizziness, vision, issues, cognitive issues, memory problems, crystals, clear quartz, amethyst, diamond, moldavite, selenite. Okay. Somebody has a crown chakra, imbalance. I'm getting it's this masculine that I'm talking about. Sacral chakra, second chakra, imbalance, lower back, fertility, PMS, digestive problems, lack of energy, kidney, gallbladder, failure. Crystals, uh, carnelian, sunstone, orange calcite, those are good crystals to use for that type of imbalance. Sacral chakra is below your, two inches below your navel, okay? It is where your creative ideas come from. It's also sexual energy, so... I'm getting this, and what I'm getting is um, some masculine energy is having, trying to contact this feminine in the 5D. They're having sex, sex in the 5D with this person because their their sacral chakra is lacking, okay? They're, they have a blockage there somewhere. This person, you know, this this masculine may really care about this feminine, but they're doing this, okay? And then somebody has an evil eye. Evil eye doesn't mean any spells. It just means someone's projecting negative energy onto you, trying to steal your energy, or they're just envious. Some people don't even know they're doing this. It just Someone could be doing it with just a really negative thought. Lemuria, Great Atlantis. You have a past life connection with Atlantis to this masculine. Crown chakra could be blocked. Their crown chakra and their sacral chakra could be blocked. Feminine, how do you know this? Because your vibrations are rising. You know this. Okay, and also there could be some kind of starseed Syrian connection with this masculine I'm talking about. We're going to find out who this is. Channel message, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Okay, let's get the um, Psychic Tarot. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Give us, uh, what is this? I need to know about the um, cleanse home, tantric sex, um, evil eye, protect yourself, Lemuria, great Atlantis, frequency, your vibrations are rising, Syrian, crown chakra, okay, sacrifice, okay. Uh, this is, I think this is the hangman in terror, um, but anyway, sacrifice. Some kind of sacrifice is being made here. This divine masculine is sacrificing this divine feminine. They're trying to, they're 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 having tantric sex with them in the 5D. Maybe this is somebody I don't know who I'm talking about here. Sacral chakra. When they do this with you, you're giving them your sacral chakra energy. It could be helping their creativity level go up. Their psych. It be it could cause could be a twin flame situation. It could be causing their vibrations to rise as well. Their crown chakra could be blocked a little bit too. So every time you do, every time, whoever I'm talking to, every time you have tantric sex with this person, they could be your twin flame or soulmate. But they're kind of being, they're kind of overdoing their control a little bit. You may feel drained. I wouldn't recommend doing it too much. That sounds weird, I know. They're kind of sacrificing, your, you know, their energy, your energy. To help themselves, which is not good. Obstacles and challenge challenges. Oh, Lord. Hmm. This is a five. Okay. Um, someone may be trying to a masculine energy may be trying to put um, ap obstacles in your way. And also we have the crown chakra. Okay. Crown chakra. Um Dizziness, vision issues, cognitive issues, memory problems. Okay, clear quartz, amethyst, diamond, moldavite, selenite. Is this masculine could have a crown chakra chakra imbalance as well? Okay, 
and they're sacrificing you to help them with this. They're, they may, I'm sure this person doesn't mean anything by it. I'm sure maybe they're, they love you. They're attracted to you. Okay. And you're having 5D sex. Okay. But it's helping them. You may be helping them, giving them some energy for them, for their vibrations to rise as well. New beginnings. Wow. The fool, they want to, they want to have a new beginning with you because they know you have the wisdom. That's two fives. Obstacles and challenges. You both could have spiritual wisdom. They know you have the wisdom as well. So they're trying to like maybe feed off your energy a little bit. I'm not trying to be mean, but somebody needs to hear this. Okay. Material and spiritual prosperity. Yep. Hmm. Solar plexus chakra. You could have, um, feminine, this is for you. You could have felt this in your gut. You could have known this was happening. I know, I'm sure maybe this person don't mean anything by it, but, you know, just so they're not overdoing their control, they're not trying to use it for the wrong reason, if y'all are following me correctly, okay? This is a weird message, so anything else I need to know? Anything else we need to know? Spirit, firm foundation. They may be seeing you as a, someone stable they could build a firm foundation with. And patience, yep. You can be very patient. All right. Okay. The universe and fulfillment of wishes. Okay. Yep. They, you're the wish fulfillment, this masculine energy. Okay. They could have ended a cycle with someone. Okay. And then we have partnerships and alliances. Yeah, they could want to form a partnership. Then we have the emperor, number four, authority. Yeah. So this is a this is definitely a, a, a divine masculine, a, a, the, an, an emperor. Okay. Divine masculine. That's our, our, that's who it is, our emperor. Okay. That's enough of that. <laughs> okay. What else? Anything else we need to know? Um, this is our person that's doing this to a feminine energy. It could be a twin flame situation. Authority who this is an emperor number four could be an Aries Aries energy or it doesn't have to be that sign Just an energy somebody that's um, in charge a divine masculine energy. They are kind of we'll just put it to you point blank They may be having you may be having tantric sex with them in the 5d because they want your energy Okay, or maybe it just makes them feel good Because your vibrations are rising divine feminine, you know, they know it too Okay, all right, authority. What is this um, authority card? Who is this? Who is this emperor? Let's get a card. What is the, what's the energy of this emperor, please? This authority card right here. This is a divine masculine. Okay. Thief. Oh, man, mm. I don't like that. I was hoping that wouldn't come out. Authority. All right, thief. All right, thief. This divine masculine here is trying to steal something from a divine feminine. All right, they're having tantric sex with them in the 5D because they're trying to steal their energy, their sacral energy. That's where your creativity lies, your spiritual gifts. They're doing this because they know your vibrations are rising. And, you know, I'm sure, let's see what else is going on. And it's a mature man, someone maybe older than the feminine. Okay. <sighs> privileged lady on the bottom, they could see you as a privileged lady. I don't know. That's a divine feminine energy right there. So we got the, the emperor and the privileged lady, which is a divine feminine, divine masculine. The masculine is a mature man, and they're trying to steal your energy. But it could be a twin flame situation. We are going to check and see. You know, I've seen the thief card and I'm like, oh, no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Mm -mm. Okay. All right. Okay, why are they... 
What else do we need to know for the Privilege Lady over here? This is a Divine Feminine Energy Privilege Lady. Yeah, you are their wish fulfillment. And I think there is, but they want your energy or something. Okay. Yeah, wealthy man, high honor, someone that's well known. Okay. That's you. That's the divine feminine energy. Okay. You're somebody in high honor. You're well known. You you know, this is divine feminine, divine and the wealthy man. The wealthy man and the mature man is the same person. The wealthy man and the privileged lady are a couple. Okay. Divine feminine, divine masculine. That's a couple on this on this deck, okay? Wow. Okay. They have maybe hold you in high honor. Oh, man. There's a false person involved somewhere. This could be someone else doing this evil eye shit here. It could be a false person involved. Who's the false person? False person. False person. False person. False person was on the bottom, so I'm going to... Okay, let's get some more information on this false person. More info on the false person, please, spirit. Expectation. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, <laughs> expectation, occupation. False person's energy is this wealthy man, mature man. They're trying to steal your energy. Um, expectation and occupation. Yep. So they want to, they may, it may be expecting you to come work for them or expecting to get up to be a part of your energy, your occupation. That sounds a little weird, but yep. Hmm. Let's see. Marriage. Um, this person may either want to marry you or they could be married. This, this emperor over here. Mature man, change. Um, this person maybe left a relationship. This emperor, wealthy man, mature man. They could have. That's trying to steal your energy. They could have got. They could have made a change. Could have moved to a new house or a change in a relationship. Hmm. Wow. Let's get a couple more, and then we'll do something else here. You know, it's weird because they they admire you. They hold you in high honor. They want to form a partnership with you. Yep, main female. Hmm. So this could be, we got the privileged lady and the main female. <laughs> this could be another person involved. This other person might know what's going on. Maybe it's somebody that they broke up with. Or this other, or they're still with, and this other person has figured it out. This could be the other woman here that has the evil eye that might be jealous. They might know what's going on. That's another. That's another scenario that I'm getting. Courthouse. Oh, wow. Yeah, courthouse. This couple could be breaking up or going through a divorce or something like that. Okay. Wow. All right. Let's just keep going here. Um. Hmm. Okay, who, let's get some cards. Who is this, um, this is a person sending you the evil eye. I don't think it's this masculine energy. I think they have somebody, main female, because you're the privileged lady and a wealthy man. Courthouse, somebody that's maybe going through a, a divorce or a separation. Who's this person giving you the evil eye, this main female? Who's giving my divine feminine the evil eye?
the Queen of Swords. <laughs> okay. This main female that's giving you the evil eye. Put that right there. Main female. Maybe something going on with this this emperor here, divine masculine, with this main female. It's the Queen of Swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay? So it's a feminine energy, Queen of Swords energy. It might be hating on you, divine feminine. Who's this emperor here? The divine, the, the one that's the emperor and the thief, the one that's trying to steal your energy, your sacral energy in particular. Who is this, please? Who's this emperor, divine masculine? And they hold you in high honor. You're, they want, I mean, it's looking like they want, but I don't know. Maybe your vibrations are going higher than theirs and they don't like it. I, I don't know. Just, anyway, you need to cleanse your home, Divine Feminine. Who's our, um, who is this, um, Emperor, please, Emperor, Emperor, Divine Masculine. Okay, let me make sure this is right because my cards are flipping all over the place. All right, who is this? Who's this emperor, thief, and um, divine masculine emperor, thief, and trying to steal this uh, divine feminine sacral energy, your creativity, your creativity, your energy, your spirit, you know, that's where you get all your creative ideas from. You could be like, you know, both of y'all could be like psychics or something like that, you know, that's what I'm getting. May not be. May just be somebody that needs your energy. That that's just, you know, they're they're not doing too good, and they need your energy. Okay, we have um, the King of Swords. Okay, so this Emperor, Divine Masculine, Thief, that's trying to steal your energy. That's a mature man. Okay, that could be in a committed relationship. Don't have to be. Maybe is going through something, going through, through some type of change with that. They want to come to you. Okay. This is the King of Swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay. Hmm. All right. So the one giving you the evil eye is, is the main female. They're giving you the evil eye. Main female, Queen of Swords. So it's the king and queen of swords, the ice king and the ice queen. So this king of swords, I don't know what's going on, why they're doing this, but but they're what they're trying to do is, is have sex with this feminine in the 5D. Who's our divine feminine? Who's our divine feminine, please? Who's the divine feminine? It's like this king and queen of swords may be going through some kind of separation. Because we got courthouse, marriage, and um Courthouse marriage, thief change, okay. Who's the feminine? We know they're the privileged lady, okay. High honor. Let's see. Okay, who is our divine feminine? The privileged lady that's in high honor. The King of Wands. Make sure. Hmm. Let's make sure. Let's make sure it's a king. Who's this divine feminine? The privileged lady, high honor. Okay. Um. <laughs> the fool in reverse. Uh. This. I don't know. They may be trying to make you look foolish. This King of Swords. They may be. May 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 think that you don't know what's going on, but you do. They may think you're the fool, like you're a fool. You won't know the difference, but you do know, because why? Your vibrations are rising. <laughs> okay, and okay, who is? I need a court card, not the fool. The fool is okay, but we need a court card for this privileged lady, divine feminine.
King of Wands. It came out again. So, our Divine Feminine, you know, Divine Feminine can be, um, doesn't, a king can be, can be, be a man or a woman. Privileged lady that's held in high honor. Okay. Possibly with their occupation. Okay. This King of Swords is doubting their, is insulting their intelligence. Okay. Trying to, they think they're a fool, but they're not. It's the King of Wands. Fire, this feminine could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. <laughs> okay. And that's pretty much cut and dry. Let's see. Let me just get a couple more cards here. Excuse me, babe. Excuse me, guys. I gotta... Dropped a card on the floor. All right, we have T edition exposed, Lorena OG Tarot. And we got a jealous feminine energy over here as well. I mean, I don't see anything wrong with having tantric sex with somebody, but when you're doing it, you don't have good intentions. Playing victim. Yeah, this uh, King of Swords Emperor energy may be like playing victim. Playing victim. Like, um, blaming everything on the feminine energy. Like, oh, they're, they're wrong. They're doing me wrong. They're not doing what I want. You know, they could just be playing it. That King of Swords knows how to, lurking, they're watching you. King of Swords is watching this Divine Feminine's every move. They're watching you. Wow, let's see, what else? They want to steal your energy, your sacral chakra. You could be like a, this divine feminine is a psychic or a reader or some kind of spiritual worker. And this, this other person could be too. I'm not sure. Maybe not. You know, they could or couldn't be. But I know that can pretty, I can tell you the feminine is for sure. Vibrations are rising. Could be a, an Atlantis past life connection. You know, you could have many past lives with somebody could be some kind of Atlantic, Atlantean connection. Um, you could be star seeds, both of you Syrian in particular. But there's a very jealous woman up here too. They could be the ones playing victim. They could be lurking as well. But this masculine is trying to steal your energy through tantric sex. Okay. Sh uh, shade. Subliminally, subliminally throwing shade. Obvious shade. So sometimes... I don't know who this masculine could be throwing shade in a really, in a quiet way, you know. You know what I mean by subliminal. They could be acting like they're the ones that's a victim. Throwing subliminal shade. It also could be this Queen of Swords main female that has the evil eye towards you, okay. They may know what's going on. Okay, somebody's contemplating doing something. Great. Okay, sorry y'all, I mean to be sarcastic. This is something that I knew about, but I, I mean, I kind of just felt it. Fight, someone wants to fight you. <laughs> it could be um, this Queen of Swords, main, main female, they might be somebody that this person's trying to get away from, or they may have um, maybe going through some type of separation, divorce. And this person has an evil eye for you. I'm talking about the, this this car, this feminine energy of this Queen of Swords. They might want to fight you. Okay. Deleting messages. Uh, feminine, you could have sent this Emperor, King of Swords, Divine Masculine, some messages. And this um, Queen of Swords, uh, probably a karmic, deleted them. Maybe they know what's going on. Okay. <laughs> Cleanse your home. Just saying. All right. Let's see, I'm not going to pull any more. Let's pull a couple more. I think this is pretty twin flame. I think this is this is the emperor and the privileged lady. Okay, could be this could be a divine feminine, divine masculine, and then this queen of swords up here is the main is a main female, but they're not a. And these two, this divine feminine, masculine, are having tantric sex, but this masculine could be just trying to steal this feminine's energy but it does look like they like they do want to be with them but maybe their energy just makes them feel better because they're depressed i don't know perception visions downloads third eye activation seeing things from a higher perspective okay this is you feminine the reason why you're able to figure this out is because 
your frequency's rising, your third eye is opening, okay? More so. Protection. Boundaries being crossed, not feeling safe, disputes, violence, territorial, protective. Just be careful there. Okay. Wow. Yeah, conflict. This um, masculine is having conflict with their person, probably a karmic. All right, anything else? They are trying, they are playing, they are feeding off your sacral energy through the tantric sex. I mean, I don't know if it doesn't bother you, then it's fine. But if you feel uh, really, really drained afterwards, um, just kind of keep it to a minimum. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to go into too much detail. I've already went into it. I've already said enough. Okay, we have strength. Yeah, this is, could be a, a Leo you're dealing with, somebody with Leo in their chart, the masculine. Or it could be, it could mean that you have a lot of strength. And maybe this person just needs your strength, okay? Maybe they're having a hard time. And this, somebody is insecure. Yes, yeah, celibacy, lack of sex, masturbation, lack of desire. Maybe this um, King of Swords, Emperor Energy, is... Um, being celibate, maybe they're not interested in their partner anymore, and they're having tantric sex with you in the 5D feminine. All right. Wow. Attraction, admiration of looks, body arousal. This king of swords, authority, emperor, divine masculine could be really attracted to you, feminine, divine feminine. All right. Maybe they work a lot. All they do is work. You know, um, shit, I ain't shit. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, I'm not mad about it, but you might be. Whoever I'm talking to, if this resonates, you might be mad about it. I don't know. Just don't over... Emperor tends to overdo their control. Okay, what type of person is this emperor, king of swords, energy, wealthy man? Okay. Thief. <laughs> well, that's one thing. They're trying to steal your energy. Okay. But at the same time, they're attracted. At the same time, they like you, and they are. Uh, yeah, okay. All right, let me see. What's the, what type of person is this emperor, king of swords energy? What type of person are we dealing with? Okay. Somebody that's indecisive. All right. This is my little deck I have here. This goes, this is like the, goes into the person's shadow side. Authority. This is our divine masculine that's overdoing their control a little bit. They're trying to steal the feminine sacral energy through tantric sex. Because they're indecisive, they do want to go towards this feminine, feminine, but they're indecisive. But they're playing like they're not. They're playing victim like it's someone else's fault. Subverted to sabotage or weaken yeah um they're trying to weaken they're trying to make you they're trying to make this emperor is trying to make you weak divine feminine so i wouldn't say they're trying to sabotage you they're just trying to weaken you maybe so you'll come to them maybe they're trying to get you to come towards them instead of them come towards you okay so they don't have to make a decision they're trying to weaken you in some weaken your power okay and out from under all right they want out from under this other person they're with this queen of swords they're distracted by you feminine they're obstructed obstructed okay maybe this is why they're doing this maybe their view of doing the correct thing is obstructed right now breached they could have breached violated breached a contract with somebody all right that's pretty much what we got this is just you know the shadow side of a person you know, we're not hating on anybody. We're not talking bad about anybody. We're just trying to figure out what's going on. Okay. Now, our feminine is this king of wands, privileged lady energy. They are trying to make you look foolish a little bit, but they should know that you're not. Divine masculine, please don't insult this person's intelligence because they're they know and they're highly psychic. All right. Let's see what the energy of this privileged lady, King of Wands energy. They could this person, this privileged lady could be an entrepreneur. What is the energy of the divine feminine and the king of wands energy? 
What is the what is the um, energy? What is what type of person are we dealing with here? What type of feminine are we dealing with? What type of feminine are we dealing with? Okay, we have um, new perspective. Okay. All right. This is um, taking back your power, the magician. So this feminine knows somebody's trying to breach their, trying to violate their, trying to take some of their energy. So they're like a magician. This 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 divine feminine is a magician energy. All right, they're going to take back. They're taking back their power right now. Okay, because somebody's overdoing their control. And conscious, okay, they may be, <laughs> you may have not been consciously aware of this. Maybe you're not consciously aware. Maybe you need to watch this video. Okay, whoever I'm talking to. Broken off, maybe you broke off, broke it off with this person. Okay, anything else I need to know? Okay, let's go get this Queen of Swords energy. This other person that's giving you the evil eye. It's this person's partner. I mean, you know, really? <laughs> you know, come on. We was born at night, but not last night. All right? Not trying to be mean, but... All right, this Queen of Swords energy. This Queen of Swords is the main male, that main female that is with this Divine Masculine, and this Divine Masculine is not happy with this person, or they could have broke up. Falling away. Okay, falling away is the Queen of Swords energy, this woman... Withdraw friendship or support to renounce one's faith to diminish gradually in size. Okay, this evil eye, this queen of swords. Let me, where did she go? Is she hiding? Queen of swords, where are you? Yeah, queen of swords. Okay, this is our, the person that this emperor is with. That's a karmic. Um, this emperor could have stopped supporting this person or drew their... You know, they 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 broke up or they're just not they're not having sex or something and what's going to happen is this evil eye because the two of you are so powerful especially you feminine it's going to diminish in size falling away to diminish gradually in size see that last definition to diminish gradually in size in size and resolved right now it's an un there's some unresolved issues between this couple that needs to be resolved. And this this emperor may be coming to this divine feminine for tantric sex and just to make them feel better. I mean, it could be very harmless, you know, but they are trying to steal their energy. And they know this. This feminine knows this anyway. Okay. Maybe they're not, you know, it's fine. Okay. But the only part, the only one I didn't like was this one right here. Someone trying to make you weak, weaken you. So you'll submit to them. Emperor could do something like that. Emperor, King of Swords, could it be overdoing their control to weaken the, this Divine Feminine so they will submit, okay? And just letting you guys know what we're dealing with. Anyway, that's what it is. Basically, a Divine Masculine is that you probably are attracted to. You guys are having tantric sex, okay? They're having trouble with their partner, partner has the evil eye for you but this um they're still in your energy they're still in your sacral energy because they have a shortage there your sacral energy is not just sex it is your creativity and if you're a psychic or if you're a spiritual worker or a healer that's where a lot of your energy comes from and also your their crown chakra could be out of balance so and maybe because they're not happy where they are they have some issues they're coming to you for that type of help but they kind of have a hidden motive. They want to weaken you so you'll submit, which is a typical thing of an emperor. You know, really? I mean, it don't have to be that way, but just saying, this the feminine knows. Now you know. Okay, whoever I'm talking to. Yeah, that's all I have. I hope this helps someone. And I will see you in my next video. And have a blessed day, evening, night, wherever you are in the country. And God bless.